Hundreds of people were evacuated from McMinniman's Edgefield after a sprinkler system burst, flooding the entire building. Elise Haas is live with more on how firefighters helped save that historic structure, Elise. Yeah, can you imagine being inside as the pipes burst inside the McMinniman's Edgeville? Just take a look at this video. As you can see, the pipes were spewing water into the hallways, all over the walls, and onto the wooden floors. And so, Gresham firefighters are the ones to rush out here to try and stop this. And there was, you know, 200 people at least that had to be evacuated because all three levels were flooded. And unfortunately, the flooding did cause extensive damage, but firefighters stopped the leak. They shut down down the power to the building and they even had to get creative to divert the excess water flow. At times they were working together to use tarps to collect and trap the water and then funnel into buckets just to protect the floors. Luckily firefighters were able to stop the water flow and minimize further damage to the historic building. Originally it was built in 1911 and formerly the Multnomah County Poor Farm and Nursing Home and later then restored and transformed into the hotel and concert venue that it is today. So we don't know how long this extensive water damage will close down the Edgeville building, but of course we're hoping that they can get it restored soon. Reporting live in Troutdale, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News. Yeah, very popular uh, property out there, Definitely. so hopefully they will be able to reopen it sometime soon. Yeah.